How long does it take a fella, a gal, or a they to tarp a load? Well, Chuck says it's no less than three hours. So what I'm going to do now is, um, I've already got it strapped and all that goofy stuff, so we're going to get about tarping. Um, we'll see how long it takes. 1.05 p.m. 1.05 p.m. Got this on the tripod and uh, we'll get to tarping. Come back, check the time. When it comes to tarping, man, there's so many variables. To Chuck or anybody else that asks, I would say, it just, I mean, it's kind of like uh, what everybody hates to hear when a question is asked, but it really just depends, man. Um, not every load is the same. In fact, very few of them are. This right here is a load of shingles. Um, this time that it's going to take me to do this tarp job is actually a little bit more than ordinary because of using the nine foot drop tarp. So I've got a lot of excess to deal with. Um, but it's definitely still within the realm of just your average load. I've definitely had loads that have taken me three plus hours, but um, those are usually more complicated ones or weather really fighting me. Wind, rain, snow, that kind of thing. 1.22 p.m. Interrupted, I have to move. They don't want me tarping right here, so. Gotta throw that front tarp somewhere else. I am now relocated, successfully. 1.29 p.m. I'm not the fastest tarper in the world. I work with a lot of people that are much quicker than me. Um, I've known some people that can tarp loads like very consistently in 20 to 30 minutes. I'm not there. Um, frankly, unlikely I'll never be there. Uh, just in virtue of the fact that my goal isn't necessarily to be fast. I'd rather be um, good at it than fast at it. But over time, as I get better at it, I do end up getting a little faster. You know, I'm usually right in that 40 minute mark. Um, sometimes a little longer, sometimes a little less, but uh, I bake about 40, 45 minutes for tarp jobs and it's usually where I lie. If you wanted unsolicited advice about tarping, I would recommend everybody to develop a process and then stick with that process and start, you know, making each individual step a little bit more efficient as you go along. You'll start learning how to minimize your movements and if you get in the habit of doing them all the same way or in the same order, you'll get pretty good at it. That's a tarp job. Two o one p.m. Two o one p.m. I certainly hope that you enjoyed watching me tarp this load to prove some kind of point about time, because. Right here on the paperwork, it says no tarp required. Dispatch said tarp though. So this is the first mix up of the year. We're off to a great start. Let's go to Colorado.